In the immortal words of Peter Parker's Uncle Ben, with great power comes great responsibility. It's just too bad this popular Twitch streamer learned that lesson a little too late. Welcome to New York, bro. Last Friday, a grand giveaway hosted by Twitch superstar Kai Sanat made headlines for all of the wrong reasons. The streamer announced an impromptu meetup in New York City's Union Square, where he promised to hand out PlayStation 5 consoles and other prizes to lucky fans who showed up on time. Attracting a massive turnout, the giveaway quickly got out of hand as members of the crowd became violent, fighting, and destroying property. A number of arrests were made before the night was through, and Sanat himself was charged with inciting a riot. Now, the streamer has returned to Twitch in an attempt to set the record straight. Several of Sanat's fellow streamers have already weighed in with their thoughts on the riot, with some arguing that none of it was his fault and others saying he should have been more aware of the danger. Now that fans have gotten a chance to hear more of Sanat's side of things, it seems the streamer's feelings fall somewhere in the middle. During his first stream since the incident in New York, Sanat expressed his disappointment in his fanbase and his astonishment that things could go so wrong so quickly. He also had a few pointed things to say to the press that have covered the event. At the top of the stream, Sanat attempted to broach the subject with a bit of self-effacing humor, holding up a newspaper with the riot coverage on the front cover and giving a bewildered look to the camera. He then acknowledged that a lot of people have been waiting to hear what he has to say, but conceded that he was still coming to terms the past few days. Still, he wanted to hop on a short stream to give people his side of the story. Sanat kicked off his comments by trying to explain why he did the giveaway as well as how he thinks things grew beyond his control. Being from New York, it has been my dream to want to give back to the community that made me who I am. He added, however, After Friday, bro, I've come to realize the amount of not only power, but influence that I have on people. The streamer denounced the actions of the rioters and said that he did not condone any of the destruction of property that occurred on Friday night referencing a series of viral videos in which attendees of the giveaway danced on top of cars and damaged them he said anything we do like this has to be safe and fun we can't be just running around and destroying this and destroying that so that went on to admit i want you all to know that none of that is how i wanted any of this to go bro i had straight good intentions and i didn't think that it was going to be what it was Sanat said he's been really looking within over the last few days and telling himself that he needs to, quote, hit up the right people and make the right calls before holding an event like this in the future. The streamer revealed that his first court hearing is currently scheduled for August 16th, but he did not provide many other details at this time, other than the fact that he was probably going to be MIA on his channel in the near future. He did, however, have a message for the media outlets and journalists covering this story as it has developed. To the news, to the media, just leave my family out of it you feel me there is no reason why y'all are showing up to my mom's house he pointed out that his mother lives well away from new york city so anyone going to her for a comment has to specifically drive out of their way to do so sanat noted that he's not concerned with what the media has to say about him because he's used to criticism and can shake his off but did appreciate people giving his family some privacy and with that sanat thanked his fans again and signed off after less than 15 minutes judging from the comments streaming in throughout his broadcast Sanat's viewers are still split on whether or not the riot was all his fault. Those debates will no doubt continue well into Sanat's court hearings, but it sounds like the streamer intends to keep his loyal fans updated.